Next we have the PFT normal values or pulmonary function testing. PFTs are tests that check the functionality of the lungs. In order to be able to interpret a patient's PFT results, you are going to need to know what's normal, right? Well, let's talk about that now. The normal FEV1 should be greater than 80% of the predicted value. The normal FEV1 to FVC ratio should be greater than or equal to 70%. The normal FVC, or forced vital capacity, should be greater than 80% of the predicted value. The normal SVC, or slow vital capacity, should also be greater than 80% of the predicted value. The normal range for airway resistance, or RAW, is 0.6 to 2.4 centimeters of water pressure per liter per second. The normal DLCO, or diffusing capacity for carbon monoxide is 20 to 25. The normal peak expiratory flow rate is 10 liters per second. And the normal value for exhaled carbon monoxide should be less than seven for non-smokers. So if you have a patient with an exhaled carbon monoxide of let's say 13, if they claim that they are not a smoker, they are most likely lying to you unless they've been sitting outside of a campfire, which is probably unlikely. All right, guys, that's it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to dive deeper and learn more about this topic, be sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel. Also, you can go to respiratorytherapyzone.com where we have a ton of free study guides, practice questions, and other resources that I think you will enjoy. I'll drop links to everything you need right below this video down in the description. And if you want to support the channel, be sure to drop a like on this video and you might as well go ahead and click the subscribe button while you're down there. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. That's it for this one. Have a blessed day and as always, breathe easy my friend.